Hey friends, this is Atif Hope here. Well and welcome to the new update on RVN. In today's video, I would like to show you this huge falling wedge pattern once again. And I would also like to share with you this very big harmonic bullish reversal setup that has been formed on the weekly time frame chart as well. And I shared this idea almost four days ago with my members. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you on the daily basis. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. So let's start the analysis. And first of all, let me begin with my most recent trade signal for RVN. That, uh, that is a harmonic bullish reversal setup that RVN formed on a weekly time frame chart. And I shared this trade setup almost four days ago with my members. And this is a very big harmonic bullish reverse regardless setup that RVN has formed with US dollar pair and the price and is still moving inside this buying zone. Therefore, this move is still in play. And before that, I shared this harmonic bullish reversal guardly pattern that was uh, being formed on a two hour time frame chart with US dollar pair. Therefore, I told my members that we can wait for the price line to drop more down. And once it will be entered in this price range, then we can expect the next price reversal. Now, after playing this chart, you can see that the price sign, as expected, and as per the Fibonacci sequence of this garlic pattern, dropped more down and completed the leg. And after the completion of this final leg, you can see it had a very nice price reversal. And this was almost 16% pump on this two hour time frame chart. Now, let's move to the weekly time frame chart. And on this live weekly time frame chart, we can see that the price sign is still moving inside. A very very big falling wedge pattern you can see we found the resistance of this wedge here in the month of feb 2021 and we got several ejections by this resistance of the falling wedge pattern and recently we got rejected here in the month of feb 2023 and after that the price and is moving down and we have also broken down this very long term and significant support of 2.7 cents as well and we can see that previously this level was breaking as a support here resistance here and then here it was breaking as a support, resistance, support. And now for the past several weeks, it is again flipped into a very strong resistance. If the price then moves more down, then it can test this very long term and key support at 1.8 cents. And for example, if it will be broken down, this support will be also broken down. Then it can test the support of this falling wedge pattern. And this time the support will be approximately at 1.35 cents. However, I'm not expecting that the price end uh, is about to break down this support because if we take a look at the stochastic oscillator on this weekly time frame chart then you can see it has completely entered the oversold zone and we have also received a bull cross that is a buying signal on this weekly time frame chart by the stochastic oscillator and previously when we can see it was dropped down at this support and the stochastic was entered the oversold zone we had a nice rally for the price and got rejected by the resistance of this falling wedge pattern and before that we can see it was entered the oversold zone and when the price and read the support of this wedge you can see it started another very nice price reversal and here we can see when the price and read the support of this falling wedge pattern and stochastic was entered the oversold zone again we had a very very nice and powerful price reversal but after every price reversal it is getting rejected by the resistance of this falling wedge pattern this time you can see that the stochastic has entered the oversold zone and we are very close to uh, this support of uh, 1.8 cents. Therefore, there is a probability that the price end may test the support, but it will be really, very difficult for the price end to drop more down to test the support of this wedge. And I'm expecting that from here, somewhere here, it can start the next price reversal. And now there is a probability that the price end may also break out the resistance of this big falling wedge pattern as well. Once the price end will be able to break out this big falling wedge pattern, then the target to the upside can be here at the top of the wedge that will be approximately at 30 cents. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.